welcome to my channel. I'm uh, not much of a morning person, so I'm like, I haven't had my coffee yet, that's the problem. And it's Monday morning, and I'm wearing my Monday shirt. It says, hello Monday, it's coffee o'clock, and it couldn't be more true. <sighs> Today I'm going to show you all what I have for breakfast, like, every single morning. Like, if you follow me on my Snapchat, you will see a picture of my oats and my coffee. Um, I actually used to think that I wasn't a breakfast person because before school I used to have like a bowl of cereal and then I'd get ready and like, I don't know, I just always felt like my stomach felt really heavy and it just didn't feel very well. So I thought I wasn't a breakfast person. So I stopped eating breakfast for years just because I thought it made me feel sick. And then I tried having oatmeal one morning and I realized I felt fine. And then, like, that kind of helped me realize that I'm lactose intolerant. And so it was the milk in my cereal making me not feel, feel very well, like I couldn't have breakfast. And so, when I found that out, I was so happy because I love food. And I discovered that I love oatmeal. Now, I don't get the oatmeal in the packets just because there's, like, okay, I read nutrition labels, like, a lot. Um, but there's a lot of sugar in the ones that are pre-packaged and pre-like seasoned and stuff like that. So I just get like the plain old fashioned oats um, and use those instead. So I'm about to show you all what, well one of the combinations of things that I put in my oats. Um, this is what I've been doing for this stretch since I've moved here. Sometimes I switch it up and put different things in my oats. But I like this combination and this is what I've had for the past two and a half weeks. So yeah, let's go make some breakfast. Alright, so I actually start off with a warm lemon water and I add honey and apple cider vinegar to it. It just kind of jump starts my metabolism and helps get rid of any toxins I have in my body. But I just use a lemon, honey that is raw and unfiltered, and apple cider vinegar. Make sure it is with the mother and not just completely transparent. Um, but yeah, while my water is heating up, I go ahead and slice the lemon. If it's a big lemon, I just use juice from half one, but this is a small one, so I went ahead and used the whole thing. Now that my water's heated up, I'm going to actually pour it in a glass for y'all, so just so y'all can see. I normally just leave it in the mug, but I went ahead and poured it in the glass, and half of it went on the counter, but that's okay. You get the point. But now I'm going to go ahead and juice the entire lemon. But lemon's just really good at detoxifying your body and stuff like that, so it just always makes me feel better first thing in the morning. And then with the apple cider vinegar and the honey, I just do about a tablespoon. I don't use exact measurements, but for those of you who do, just go ahead and put an exact tablespoon. I don't feel the need to really measure it out super accurately, plus it's first thing in the morning. I don't have time to stress over it. And then with this, since there is the acid from the lemon, I always drink it with a straw just to kind of protect the enamel on my teeth. Um, and this drink is kind of an acquired taste. I've just always liked it, but for most people it's acquired. Now for the coffee, I always drink black coffee. So I'm just going to go ahead and start a pot. I didn't used to drink black coffee, but I did start for health reasons and stuff like that because I had a ton of sugar. Now, to make my oats, I use old-fashioned oats, unsweetened vanilla almond milk, I like creamy peanut butter, um, cinnamon, oh I love cinnamon, it's good for your digestion, and then half or a whole banana, just depends on what's available. Now, it doesn't matter to me what brand of oats I use, as long as it's old-fashioned, I use generic a lot too, but I just look at about a half a cup of oats for a full cup of water. Now one thing I love about oats is that they're so affordable, like a big can like that is good for like a month and it's anywhere from $2.50 to $3 for a whole month. Now I'm going to go and cheat and put it in the microwave um, and while I do that I'm going to slice my banana. But yeah, I microwave it for about a minute and 45 seconds and now I'll start adding my toppings. And I, I do always lay out my banana like this, like I know it's insane. And then I just kind of scoop the peanut butter with the spoon I'm going to use. And then time to add cinnamon, cinnamon, and more cinnamon because I love it so much. And then um, I just kind of add a splash of the unsweetened vanilla almond milk. 
it's already sweet there's no need for the extra sugar so but yeah I just it adds a lot of calcium to it too and now my coffee is ready and it is time for the famous snapchat picture of my breakfast I post it every morning got a filter caption and now I can eat my food Alright, thank y'all so much for having breakfast with me. I hope y'all enjoyed my healthy breakfast that I like to eat. I feel so much better now that I've had my coffee and my oatmeal. And I really like it because oatmeal kind of gives you a good base for like a balanced breakfast. Because you get your carbs from your oats and then you get your protein from the peanut butter and the oatmeal. And then, I mean, you get your healthy fats from the peanut butter as well. So, I mean, it's kind of really all well-rounded and I love the feeling of just warm food in my tummy first thing in the morning and then coffee and I'm sorry I forgot to mention earlier that I have like that lemon water concoction like sometimes I have just plain lemon water but a lot of times I like to add the apple cider vinegar and the honey to it because it just kind of helps wake up your metabolism and your digestion and it just I think the honey helps me feel more energized too just because like all the sugars and stuff in it but um I like to have that first thing in the morning because sometimes I have tummy problems but yeah, and it's also just really good for you to clean out the toxins because the lemon juice and all that. But yeah, so I just um, hope you all enjoyed my little morning food routine. And uh, if you enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe and um, notify the, like, the alert thing so you know whenever I post a new video. Um, share it with your friends and if you try it for breakfast, let me know if you liked what I made this morning. Um, that way we can be like breakfast buddies in a way. Anyway, um, if y'all have any suggestions on what y'all would like to see on my channel regarding like either health or fitness or music or anything at all, feel free to leave a comment. Um, I can't promise I'll get to all of them or right away, you know, but I'll do my best. I'd love to know what y'all would like to know. Thank you. Y'all have a blessed day.